Ahead of school reopening, Education Cabinet Secretary George Magoha asked teachers to be creative in applying the COVID-19 guidelines, mentioning studying outside under trees as one of the alternative measures. Including open spaces, weather permitting. By the way, most people don't know that learning under a tree is extremely healthy because the trees remove carbon dioxide and give more oxygen. The sentiments by Education CS elicited an approval from Kenyans who termed the option as a backward move. On social media, Kenyans were angered and disappointed by the seemingly failing education system amid COVID-19. Renowned youth comedians also found humorous way to express their displeasure in the matter. <laughs> While Kenyans somehow thought the move was not applicable, on Monday, the first day of schools reopening, students in different counties among them Nyeri and Kakamega counties were seen in the actual situation and are tree and learning. Dr. P.K. Wanyoike, a neurosurgeon at Brain Spine and Rehabilitation Center, says there are disadvantages of studying outside as prolonged poor sitting posture may cause serious spinal defects. The spine sometimes bends if you are in a wrong posture for a long time. So what we call a postural uh, uh, a scoliosis or scoliotic deformity of the spine. Eh? Although this tends to uh, correct itself. Dr. Wanyoike associates humid weather conditions to severe headaches, saying windy and cold weather are not favorable to school going children as they may develop a certain health conditions such as pneumonia. When it is very cold, of course, that is associated with low body temperatures. So, uh, the development of pneumonia, the development of swelling of the legs and the hands, right? Because of uh, those extremes, we occur. Images of students studying outside continue to circulate on social media. The students have been seen concentrating hard on their white books in the scorching sun, a situation Dr. Wanyoike also says may cause a series of eye defects such as conjunctivitis. It is difficult to learn under the hot sun. The disadvantages of bright lights on the eyes. Um, that will cause, uh, uh, may cause headaches in the vision. The children may develop allergies in the eyes. A struggle in maintaining COVID-19 protocols and an influx of students in public schools has been evident this week. If this continues, more students may be forced to study outside under a tree, leading to an escalation of more problems. Mombi Wambogo, K24 at Parklands, Nairobi.